Hey, what's up everybody? Sonic Rebel XD here, and today we are back with another episode of our Digi Nuzlocke. And last time, I am very sorry about all my rambling and stuff. This is going to be very hard, and I've ex the editor me explained it. But I tried to be as strategic as possible because I am trying to limit myself while also making it manageable and fun. So, after doing a bit of research, I kind of know what I need want to do with my starter. So, I will explain that when I get there. But, as of right now, we are in a new route. And we are ready to actually uh, get a new Digimon, I hope. But first... We got our tank mon. He is ready and willing to go. I will be doing a care or my Digimon introductions if they change every so often. So yeah, I'm excited for today, and let's get started on this. Oh, why are you not? Okay. Oh, oops. Okay, so I can get stuff here. Good, good, good. Yeah. Revisit dungeons and stuff, which is nice for training and stuff. And then there's that. I think I've. I thought I. Ah, uh, return to data. Did I not do this yet? No. Oh, I gotta do these now. Yeah. Okay. Good. I've done everything. Let me leave. Thank you. Seems like you understand the Digilab now. It may seem like a fluke, but there must be some meaning behind your arrival here. Make good use of these facilities and deepen your interactions with the Digimon. Finally, one last thing. A small token for you. What the frick? You got a hacking skill. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it, I know what this is. I'll try to, ex it's easier to explain once I actually get there. Hacking skills shine in combining with Digimon, use, uh, with Digimon use, but are dangerous if used for unscrupulous purposes. Still unlike, uh, still unlike the other one, you seem to be a true hacker, so I suppose it goes without saying. It looks like it wasn't just your fate, but another source of help that guided you. The girl in white. Even now she tries to get a hold of this place. Do ask her to pace herself. This place may seem like your virtual world, but it is actually completely different. You'll never be able to analyze it using your protocols. You seem different from the other one, so I've made a separate entrance for you. Feel free to use it anytime. I got the Digilab URL. Now remember, when you arrive at an Im impasse upon the road you must walk, True to turn to the bonds with your Digimon you have raised for support. That power will surely change your fate, perhaps even the fate of another. I'll see you later, take care. Basically, oh, such a strange one. The two wheels of fate begin to turn in completely different directions. This may be proof that the world has expanded far beyond my expectations. I'll assert ascertain the hidden potential of you and your Digimon with my own eyes. Can I talk now, please? Nope. Oh, you're back. With a new Digimon. <laughs> Illegal process discovered. Illegal process discovered. Come to the security center at once. So, where'd you go? What? I sent you without knowing where you'd go? Yeah, I wanted to go myself, but I kept getting repelled. I lost track of you in Route 2. Give me your log later, I'll try to try analyzing it. Also, uh, I also want subjective data. What you observed with your own eyes. What was over there? Hmm, I see. Well, that's enough. Let's go. I don't want to know who that woman was. Not, not really. My conjecture was pretty much on the ball, so... From your story, I'd have to guess that you met the Cyber Witch. She must be a remarkable hacker. 
Everything adds up if you think of it like that. Like that. The reason we can't perceive the hidden room in cyberspace is because she keeps moving it around. You can't do that in a place like Eden without processors on an enormous scale. It's possible for such a thing to exist in Eden. See, they weren't tales of the occult after all. The cat? If we analyze the log, we'll see it was just, uh... Jeez, think for yourself for once. <laughs> the frick? Help me! Oh, Flip, it's this guy. I forgot what his name was. Bugmon. <laughs> we got Bugmon and then we got Killer Wasp Mom, I think. I don't know. All these names are freaking weird. The Scream came from inside, let's go. Okay. And I can use these now. Can I use this? No. Or not. Can't use acceleration either. Okay, so we got our freaking tank that's behind us. And I know I could get Digimon here. I need to, I, I'm getting my log out real quick. Gosh dang it, I need the right stuff. Down! Where's my numbers, there's my numbers. Okay. Run, 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 run. I guess I'll go fight this guy then, and then I'll just kinda get somebody as I go along, maybe? Oh, here we go. Back attack. What? How are you faster than me? I'm a freaking tank. Okay, so we got... Ooh, we got some interesting ones. Um... I don't remember what they're called, though. I'm gonna write them down real quick, if my phone actually loads. Okay, so in Kaloon level 1... Hello, please. Thank you. Okay, we got... A Pabumon. And then... We got... What's his flip? Pyomon. Or Poyomon. Can't freaking spell. All right, cool. So now I just need to encounter these guys. All right, let's uh, bop you. Get him, tank. Yeah. I hope we level up from this, so then I can actually heal. Ow. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's get it. I did level up. Nice. Cool. Alright, I think I'll do this, um, three more times. I'll be back when I'm done. And we're back. We've, we've leveled up once from our three encounters. But now it's time to head on over and fight this guy. <laughs> Ye I'm done for... Go on and help it. Understood. Let's do it. Get you, you freaking wasp mon. Are you wasp mon? Oh, over box. Yo, that's nice. Ow. Oh. Uh oh. This isn't good. Do I have healing items? I do. Okay. Um. Get it, come and have a. Yeah, you do good bit. Oh, why does it do so much? I'm paralyzed here. This is unfortunate. Uh oh. Okay, I am going to uh, heal. Ah, gosh dang it. I can ban defense up. Okay. Come into hammer! Let's use Hyper Cannon! Get it! Nice! Mama. Yeah! Level up if we got an escape gate too. Nice! Are you okay? Ugh! And he's back. Now it's a hacker! 
What's with that reaction? We just saved you, you know. Who, who are you? Don't move. There, I've healed your wounds. Just mimicked what my brother would do. Now, are you better now? Yeah, thanks a bunch. You guys are good hackers, ain't ya? I'm Wormmon. Nice to meet ya. Guess Digimon attack each other too, huh? It's all my fault. I was wandering around Kaloon when I slipped and fell. That Digimon was there and it freaked me out, so I launched my special move, Sticky Net. Yeah, that's definitely your fault. <laughs> Ooh, I'm always like this. I've always chased by strong Digimon in my hometown too. I ran off and before I knew it I end up ended up here. I don't remember how to get home. I'm lost. Hometown? For Digimon? Yep, my hometown's called the Digital World. The Digital World? Yeah, it's a world separate from this one. Say, this is the human world, right? Our world, this is Eden, a virtual place created by humans. I thought so. I don't know how uh, much about it, but I've heard there's a place where the digital world overlaps with the human world. The two worlds weren't connected in the beginning, but intersected at some point. I've had to use... I have to abuse that connection to get over here too. Are you sure you're not bugging out? But why would you say something like that? There's no way there's another world. It just can't be true. I'm not bugging out. The digital world does exist. Hmm. What do you think? I believe it. <laughs> Thanks a bunch. I think it's a bit hasty to believe such an absurd story so soon. The digital world really exists, honest. All the Digimon in this virtual space came from the digital world, just like me. Well, it's true that no one knows the engineer who created the Digimon. As programs, they're too perfect to just form spontaneously. Still, it couldn't be. So you don't believe me, do ya? Fine, I give up. I didn't say I don't believe you. So? I didn't say I did... Uh, I didn't say I believe you either. Let's table this for now. There's not enough information to verify your claim. Still happy to hear it. You're a nice one, ain't ya? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Oh my gosh, so much talking. But now what should I do? I want to go back to the digital world, but I don't know how. It's not like we know the answer. What do you want to do about it? Me? Well, I... Just be clear, don't go counting on me. I don't care about Digimon in the least. So sad. He's doing the puppy dog eyes. Oh my gosh. Uh. uh wanna come with me? No. Wow. Huh? If you have nowhere else to go, then you can come with me. Unless you figure out how to get home. Wow, we honest? That thinks a bunch! I was so lonely by myself. Hip hip hooray! He broke me down. <laughs> what are you looking at? What was I supposed to do? It's not like I could leave him on his own. He's so happy and he talks a lot for a Digimon. He's so clumsy. What a weird kid. Still, there's something interesting about him. Thank you for saving him. And, uh, sorry for hitting you with Natan. A me, Natan. But if you come into my room again without knocking, you'll get the same. Hey, Wormon, come on. Okie dokie. Oh my gosh. That was a lot of dialogue. Oh, I have to save? Okay. Sure. No, I want to save, please. Jeez, man. Alright. Oh. I see. We'll look into the monster that attacked Shiga on our end. Do you have any idea what it could be? I didn't look... It didn't look like a Digimon to me. We've never seen such a thing. We've heard the same story... A kind of story from other hackers. We're gathering info as we speak. 
Hey, is it okay to leave Shiga on his own? Maybe he just faked an error on his account to run off. It's pointless to go after a small fry like that any further. What do you mean by that? There was someone behind the scenes using Shiga's and other independent hackers to gather accounts. We don't, uh, if we don't beat that guy down, we can't stop the wave of account raids. So the next case is tracking down the string puller, huh? Looks like you get it. I leave it to you. I don't care how you do it, but rest assured, you better not go uh, easy on them. Anyone who crosses Zexon's gonna pay, and pay big time. She's a scary one. What do you know? What do you know? The gang's all here. You. Well, look who it is. Errata? Errata. Errata of that has been hacker team Jude. You're Faye, Zaxxon's second in command, if I remember correctly. I've heard plenty of rumors. It's been a while, hasn't it? You got some nerve showing your face in front of us, uh, Sanada. Hey, Ryuji, knock it off. Here to apologize after all this time? That again? Let it go already. The past is the past. What'd you say? Seriously, give it a rest. Faye's here, too. Think about where, where you are. Don't mind me. Go for it. Now that I think about it, you two used to be in Jude, huh? Uh, Jude, right? Even if the team broke up, you old friends should have a nice chat. I'll get out of your way, so take your sweet time. I'll leave the matter we talked about to you guys. Uh, things are gonna get busy around here. Zaxxon, huh? Guess you guys are all buddy-buddy now, huh? No. So what's going on with Eden Hackers? Those guys have been acting funny lately. More and more of them are running amok. Zaxxon claims to be upholding the peace, but I don't see it that way. It wasn't this way back in our day. We were more free back then, weren't we, Ryuji? Shut up! Don't talk like you know everything. This has nothing to do with you. You're the one that ran away, after all. Well, he said it for me. Ran away, huh? Can't argue with that. Wait up, Ryuji. It wasn't like that, was it? I mean, he had his own stuff going on too, you know? Sorry. What's done is done, yeah? Just don't look like that in front of Erika, okay? The newbie Korin, neither. Neither. We're Hundy now, after all. Yeah, you're right. I'll head back after I clear my head a bit. Word. Then I'll head back first. It's me. Got it. Send me the details. We were more free back then, weren't we, Ryuji? Don't gloss over how things really were. Now we're in chapter 3 already? What the freak? Okay. And here I am. I need to go get those Digimon. Ryuji and Chitose aren't back yet. Maybe I should check the bulletin board. Hey, why is this room over there off limits? You mean you don't know? That's the unopened VIP room. It's famous for causing misfortune around those who try to enter. The misfortune? Students of the homeroom of my acquaintances, friend's cousin went in there and met with all kinds of misfortune, I'm I'm told. Their devices crashed, embarrassing pictures of them got out, they got stuck in an automatic door, bitten by a dog, had black cats cross their path. Eve, stop it already! Hey, now that I think about it, I heard a weird shriek when I passed by that room a moment ago. Don't tell me I've been cursed too! Better go see an exorcist, I'll go with you. What the frick? Okay. Sounds like Erica's room has a strange rumor associated with it. Wait, did he say Shriek? I am not going in there again. <laughs> Eep, stop! Somebody help me! 
Uh, what? What the frick are you doing to Wormmon? Mm. Texture slapped on top of wireframe skeleton. Same as our avatars. I see the wireframe is way more detailed than on the human avatars. Oh, it's you! You gotta save me! Erica's trying to dissect me! What the frick? It's analysis, not dissection. Stop making me look bad. I haven't taken you apart or anything, have I? Although I might want to give that a try. <laughs> Keep! You're a Digimon now, aren't you? It's only natural you'd get analyzed and adjusted. But, but having you look inside my body is embarrassing. And kind of tickles. I don't understand how data can be ticklish. Can I help you with something? There's a weird rumor about this room. You, you must mean the unopened VIP room thing. Once in a while, a customer tries to come in here for kicks. I hacked them as a little slap on the wrist, and that's how those spooky rumors started. It's not like I never leave this room. Plus, the others come and go pretty often. Anyone who paid attention would get it. Really, what a pain. Hey, Erica, what's spooky? I'll teach you how to search for it on the net so you can find out for yourself. Hooray! Erica teaches me all kinds of things. Thanks to her, I'm learning all about your world over there. You're my Digimon, after all. Can't have you stay dumb forever. Hey, so listen to this. I thought Digimon were just computer gro programs, but it looks like I was wrong. These guys have a feature that lets them read and learn from external data. Even without human help, they absorb data around them to grow on their own. Even if they're destroyed, they have an uh, optional structure of self-reproduction. In other words, they're just like organic life forms. I wonder if all programs from the digital world are like this. Say, Wormon, tell me wor more about your world. Sure, but if I do, will you stop dissecting me? Analyze, analyzing, and sure, I'll think about it. Hip hip hooray. Oh my gosh. Stop talking. Let me at least skip. Okay, well, in the digital world, there are rivers of dead data particles and... And I'm getting a call from somebody. Walk, walk. Ah, it's this guy. Looks like you've made some reliable allies. Okay. You've, you got it. Looks like Shiga was the hacker you're after. I'm sad to hear it myself. What? You think it's strange that I know about it? I know the ins and outs of Kulun. It's easy to get my hands on that much info. Plus, Hundi itself is pretty famous among hackers. There's Axon's confident, uh, confident, confidants, you see. Let me give you some advice. Don't go trusting those guys too much. Those guys are hackers after all. You have no idea what they're up to behind the scenes. It, it was wise of you not to mention me. I don't know what they told you, but don't be tricked by their promises. Who am I, you ask? <laughs> I'm your ally. Your one and only ally, actually. I'll send information on your next target. His name is Toru Ka Kayaba. He abuses personal information flowing in the darkness through account rating to extort money from people and businesses. He has an impressive collection of accounts. Try and track him down. Okay, what in the world could he be after? T Toru Kayaba. Have a check the okay. So that's this is where I do jobs and stuff. Oh I got messages and stuff. Okay, cool. I should thank you and nothing else. Alright. Now it is time to go get those Digimon so that I can freaking level up. Or get new Digimon and level them up and stuff. So, I shall be right back. And we are back, everyone. We finally got these guys up there. And now, it's time to grab them. Oh my goodness. That took a little bit. I'm going to be using the rest of this time to kind of grind these guys up and get them good. Or at least... That's my plan. So we got a Poyomon and a Pabumon. 
got those guys, but we're gonna be using, well, except for him and him. We need those guys. Okay, so... Yeah, okay, we want you over here. Okay, what could these guys digivolve into? Pablumon. One of the three. Hmm. I'm not exactly sure. And then Poyomon. One of those three. I think I know what I want. Alright, let's go, um, train them up. saw from that little montage that I did there I was able to get Yokomon and Tokomon now these two were gonna be I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do cuz I don't exactly remember all the digivolutions that we could do for instance like I have I have no clue who the frick that guy is right here. Like I could do this one, which is I could do this one, which is uh, if I can remember the bird. It's the bird. I don't remember her name though. I don't want to do that guy though because he looks like a freaking mushroom. Then we could do Wormmon if we wanted, but it would be nice to have a vaccine type. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not sure what that is though, so I'm not gonna do that. But, then we got Tokemon. Now, Tokemon has a lot of variety that it can become. For instance, we could go Patamon and uh, go on to the Angemon route, which can be pretty nice. We could go on this freaking Eagle, 
thing, or this guy here. But, then we got this thing. Which is a level... It requires level 30, and it requires a lot of ABI, which means we would have to... Increase this level, de-digivolve it, increase this level, de-digivolve it, and then digivolve it again. And uh, all that crazy crap. Or... We can get this thing. Which, this thing is... A sister mod. A sister mod bull... Not Blanc. Um... Maybe it's Blanc? Frick, I don't remember her name. But this lady is supposed to be really good. Like... Fairly good. Problem is, though, is that... She can only go up to champion level, I think. So we might be at a huge disadvantage there. But... I can't, I know what I want to do with Tank Mon. The, I do know what I want to do with Tank Mon, but this is going to be a little... difficult to figure this out. I will be doing some research before the next episode hits, so that I kind of know what I want to do with those guys. But anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this crazy dialogue crap, and uh, we got our new members, so yay! The so, thank you all for watching, I hope you all enjoyed. If you guys have a suggestion for what Digimon you guys want me to use, uh, use for uh, Yokomon and Tokemon, please let me know. Um, I'll be doing research myself, and my decisions might be influenced by the decisions that you guys want me to make. So, I hope you all have a great day. Please like, share, and subscribe, and uh, pay a visit to Maximus Phoenix and uh, Anorak Gaming Studios. Alright, Sonic Rebel XD out.